despacito. Quiero respirar tu cuello despacito. So I already filled in my brows as usual. I know they look a little bit, you know, crazy, but you know, I'm trying. Um, I wanted to get on the camera for you guys today and just kind of do my makeup because I haven't done my makeup in forever. And I'm gonna start off by using this e.l.f. Mineral Infused Face Primer. And I just wanted to do my makeup because I haven't done my makeup in like forever. Although I have like all of my makeup at school. Well, not all of it, but like some of it. I just don't feel like doing my makeup. So I don't. And there's really no need for me to wear makeup. Like, because I just go to class and I come back to my room and like that's it. But I just wanted to get on the camera for you guys because I think I've been gone for like two weeks and I haven't posted anything but that's because like it's been crazy like I've never been so stressed before and school just has me by the throat right now and I finish next week with my classes finish on the 12th and I'm just about to use this baby skin instant pore eraser primer so my classes finish on the 12th of December and then after that I only have two exams that I need to take like I need to physically be at the university at well on the 14th and then after I finish my last exam on the 14th I'm going home for Christmas break and I'm off for like a month and like I feel great about that I've been waiting for Christmas break because I've I've been needing a break but at the same time it's like okay grades are due and like I'm stressing I don't know like I wasn't this stressed last year I don't think maybe I was I just don't remember but I really don't think I was this stressed this year last year as I am this year and I'm just using for foundation this Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless Foundation in 322 Golden Caramel and honestly I've been using the Finny um the Finny Beauty products like a lot every time I do do my makeup which I don't do it often like I said I've been using the Finny Beauty products a lot so I'm just gonna try to change it up a little bit I hate how like this doesn't have a pump like you guys know that I love pumps and I'm like really lazy today I don't feel like doing too much um I don't know what brush I should use like I didn't bring oh yes I did so I'm just gonna use this Real Techniques Real Techniques blending brush just looks like this to blend out the foundation and I think this is like more of my summerish color like it's a little tan but I think it should be fine it's not like too too tan so yeah so I've like been super stressed with this university stuff like I've just been freaking out on the inside like <sighs> on the outside I hold it together like I'm like oh, okay like I have this and that too but like on the inside like I'm flipping out and like losing my mind but I think that's like a lot of college students right now so I'm not alone but it's just like I kind of miss high school in the sense that I didn't stress as much and I've said numerous times like I think on some of my good ready with me's or like where I actually talk in videos um that I'm studying psychology with a minor in Spanish and like psychology is so hard y'all like it's not even psychology itself like I've had to take math classes and math is just it's not my thing me and math do not get along and I just I cannot stand math oh this foundation looks pretty good it's probably a little tan but um I'm really not going anywhere so it doesn't really matter make sure I get everywhere this has pretty nice coverage and it sits well on top of the um, two primers that I used but aside from college and like the stress from that like I'm minoring in Spanish like I said and I did a language video like I don't know a while ago and it was like how I learned Spanish and I've been wanting to learn more languages and like stuff like that and I'm just using my Tarte I always get this name wrong shape tape I always say tape shape but like it's yeah it's shape tape and this is in medium this may be like really light I don't know I haven't used this concealer in forever either because I just been using the Finny 
um, beauty products and I'm just gonna put like a little bit of this because I don't need a lot so I've been wanting to learn like other languages besides well other than Spanish because even though Spanish like I love it and Spanish has my heart I just have taken an interest in learning other languages like Portuguese Italian Farsi and even Russian like I don't know where all of this sudden wanting to learn language like I've wanted to learn those languages like for a while but just actually acting on it you know like how people want to do things but like they don't actually like do them or like they're not motivated to do them but it's just something that they want to do that's kind of how I was for a while but like now I actually want to take the time to learn these other languages like after I'm completely like mastered Spanish um because I just I don't know I think it's so cool like I watch videos when other people are like other people speaking other languages and I find it so fascinating like how some people can speak like I don't know eight different languages it's like crazy to me but it's so fascinating I'm just like oh I wish I could do that but it's all a learning process and I'm using oh this silicone um blender I use this in my first impressions video of like trying new makeup and I'm still, um, I don't know if I like this to blend out my makeup as much, but we're just gonna, like, go with the flow. And I'm going back in with the brush to kind of even out the concealer and the foundation so it's not, like, a harsh contrast from, like, my, con my concealer shade to my foundation. I can't see, like, I don't have contacts in. Um, I plan on wearing my glasses, so, and the reason why I'm sitting down doing this video is because I wanted to do my makeup, like, a little bit, but I also have another video to film. I have a review for you guys, and I can't, like, put it up until this company, um, says it's okay, and I'm just using my airspun powder. What else is new? And I'm just gonna use this little, like, fluffy brush. I always use this for my powder. I think you guys have seen this so many times. And I'm just going to like set my eyes. Oh, this brush is a little damp. Set wherever like I put the concealer. If anyone knows of like a good translucent like powder that isn't um, loose powder, please let me know because this stuff gets really messy and like it works really well. But I like, you know, like a setting powder that's actually in the pan instead of like a loose powder because this gets everywhere and it's super messy so if you guys know of anything like please let me know in the comments so then now I'm just going to quickly you know bronze up my face um this never changes well it does I used to use my next one a lot but this is the wet and wild one and I'm just going to use my favorite brush to bronze with which you guys have seen me use like I don't know how many times every time I do my makeup so now I'm just sorry my phone is like vibrating and I'm just like who is messaging me bronze up a little bit these brushes are like damn when did I wash these oh yeah so basically these videos these get ready with me videos are like kind of hard to do because you have to like talk the entire like I don't want it to be awkward so I'm trying to like talk about things but then I forget about what I'm talking about when I try to tell you guys the products it's a struggle like I don't know it's such a struggle but I wanted to like do a get ready with me something simple something that isn't gonna like take me forever like makeup wise and that's the thing like I haven't even been watching makeup videos lately like I really haven't I watched some makeup videos but like not a lot and I don't know, like, I just haven't really been feeling my makeup. I mean, I haven't even done it in forever. Like, every time I think about makeup, like, I'm just like, mm. you know, that takes work. Like, I don't really feel like it. And if I do, like, I don't feel like putting on falsies or any of that. And I'm actually going to use my um, highlighter that I really have been liking from, and no, it's not Fenty Beauty. I love that one, but I said I'm not going to use any Fenty Beauty products today because 
that's usually typically what I reach for if I do my makeup. So I'm just going to use my Wet n Wilds um, highlighter in Crown of Canopy. And I use this in my Get Ready With Me as well. And I really, really like this. Like, it's super pretty. And I'm just taking it on my Morphe M501 brush. And it's, like, nice and subtle. Like, I'm not trying to do too much today, like I said. But you can definitely build this up and it doesn't look, like, cakey or anything. So... I've been wanting to get back into makeup and like practicing it like these brushes are so damp okay and practice my makeup more but I've been so busy with school like I've been so tired when I come back to my room after classes and I'm like doing my homework or like I quickly like watch a show while I'm doing my homework I just want to go to sleep after that like sometimes I don't even want to eat like and I love food like if you know me personally you know that I love food and all I do is eat, but like after I come back from class and I finish my homework, I just want to go to sleep. Favorite mascara, the Benefit Roller Lash. And actually in August, like this coming August, I want to study abroad in the Dominican Republic because I want to take the opportunity because like I was thinking about it and I'm just like I mean this is a really great opportunity for me to study abroad and like to actually practice my language skills and also like achieve fluency if that makes sense because typically when you're in a country that speaks a different language you know other than your native language you learn it faster because you're you're forced to use the language because that's how they speak there and that's why I want to study abroad and also because I can get like credits and that's like the best of both worlds like I'm learning the language that I want to learn and I'm doing things that I want to do but I also get credits for it when I come back and I just I think that's awesome and I want to study there for a semester so it would be from August to the beginning of December and everyone else would still be in class at that point but when I came back like if I study abroad when I come back at the beginning of December like I just would go home and like just chill until the next semester starts but also next year like i want to um live like off campus because i want to bring nala and my cat ace because that's like why i come home so much is like literally for them because i miss them so much when i'm at school and they relieve so much stress like it's ridiculous how much stress they can relieve it's amazing so that's why like i want to live off campus and stuff but i plan on studying like if i get like accepted because i did apply i plan on studying for a semester like i said and like that's from august to the beginning of december like i said and i just know that i'm gonna miss my animals so much like i can't even go a week without freaking out like i'm always asking for pictures and always asking to see them like I'm gonna be struggling for like the three months that I'm there but it's an opportunity like I don't want to miss this opportunity because this is the time to do it like when I graduate college and like I'm looking for a job I mean what job is gonna give me like three months off so I can go travel and like learn a language like I don't think that's very likely so it's just best to do it now when I'm in school and when I can get credit for it so that's what I want to do I think it's pretty cool and if I did study in um, the Dominican Republic I would be studying in Santiago and I just I don't know I'm so excited like I haven't even been accepted yet but like I'm so excited because I really want to go there and like to eventually like study there but not just study but actually live there for like a period of time with the host family like that would be amazing I just I'm so excited and I haven't even been accepted yet. But hopefully I do get accepted because it's it's something that I, I truly want to do. Even with my glasses on, I still can't find nothing. Okay. So I'm just going to use this lip gloss because the one that I want to use isn't up here. And I'm just going to use this one from Wet n Wilds, Panning for Gold. I use this in my Wet n Wilds tutorial. Well, everything Wet n Wilds. Yeah, like this isn't really like glossy. Like you can see like a little bit of the color pale, but it's not like glossy you know what I mean so let me zoom you guys in um so if you guys enjoy get ready with me videos don't forget to hit that like button don't forget to comment 
And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you are a part of the family. I'll definitely be posting more as soon as I finish, you know, my exams and everything. So over break, like you already know, I'm going to be posting like crazy. And we're just going to have a good time. So don't forget to subscribe, like I said. And I will see you guys in my next video.